Hello everyone and welcome back to Song of Horror. And now I know you will be questioning, was I always a black man? <laughs> black detective. No, I wasn't. So what happened was... Ah, ah. Oh shit! So now I have played the first episode all over again without Sophia being my first character and this young gentleman is my character now. And so we are gonna see where to go next. Also, his passive ability. Uh, well, it, nope. Calm down, it's nothing. Alright, now I think I can talk. So, um, what was I talking about? I forgot. So, nothing is much different. And also, yeah, his passive ability is this thing. Uh, notepad. Uh, he has written down uh, the Hushers family residence and their family names. That is useless. Let me inform you, this is goddamn useless. I already knew all the information. I don't know why it's still there. Alright, so we come here. And there's a broken ladder over here. So, also I got a super glue last time. No? no? What about the paint thinner? Oh, reach the hook. Alright, so I think I'm looking for something tall and long. Oh, the dollhouse. Yeah, we found you in the bathroom. Which one are you? Um, that's the one with the ponytail, right? Um, I think you're from here and you are definitely from the bedroom, that much I know. I don't know about the doll puzzle yet. Hopefully I will know what to do by the end of this episode or else I am freaking lost. Also, we still have not yet found the painting. I have no clue where the paint thinner goes. I'm gonna go back in the yard and see if there's anything long and uh, hooky that I can take. What is this question mark on my screen? Mm -hmm. Do I really need to look for something in there? Well, if it's giving an option... Wait, okay. Or something is gonna happen. Surely. I played the entire fucking game just to lose the goddamn character that I loved and cared about. <sighs> this game, I hate it. I despise this game now. Every character I play it just dies. Alright, so what's the your ability? Ah. 
Bro, I didn't even know what it was. What Carlos assures me the moment of peace, everything seems to go quiet, even the stream like Xander. Well, I would have it would have been great if I knew what it does before I took a goddamn sip that has only one use. Uh, okay. Wait, what? Laundry room is empty, but there's water everywhere. It was a troll, wasn't it? Was it a goddamn troll? This I uh, this game. This game is ah uh, it just mmm yeah the Oh boy ah uh, it was empty the bathtub was goddamn empty There's one locked door over here as well if I remember Yeah Um uh, You gotta be kidding me Hold on um yeah, no, uh, it will just throw away items which are useless. All right, uh, hiding place. Good heavens. What is that? Oh, they are birds, I see. I got the firewood. Uh -huh. All right, combine? Okay, not this. Let's go and see about the firewood. I wonder if I'm going to get my characters back in the end of, at the end of this episode or not. Oh, run towards it, my man. All right. Oh, boy. Man has cool tattoos on his hand. Demon. Yeah, demons, am I right? All right, um, okay, um, nice, that's what we need the paint thinner for. What does that do? Someone split the key to the storeroom in two ways and left left half inside the lock. Oh, that makes sense. Because it does. Alright. What's inside? There's something that's going to kill me the moment I step in. How's the things? Oh, we got another note. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Dear Sebastian, everything is falling apart. I don't know what's happening to my telephone, but I can't seem to reach you, which is why I'm writing this. As I do, I pray that it's not too late, Sebastian. Do not listen to the music box. I repeat, do not listen to that music box. Something is wrong with that melody. I hear it over and over in my head while I walk when I read, when I eat or sleep, even in my dreams, and these are getting worse and worse. I feel observed, Sebastian. At first it only happened in my dreams, but lately I also feel like feel it while I'm awake. Although I find it increasingly hard to tell the difference these days. There's something here with me, a strange presence. In the hall, behind each door I turn my back to. I don't know what's happening to me. I'm so sorry, my dear friend. I curse the day I sent you that box. A letter from Husher, post stamped on 15 August 1989, found at his home. Third letter from Isaac Faber. Oh, look at that. Uh -huh. 
A metal hook. You don't know where this leads. This is for the attic. Hopefully this young gentleman will not die just as Anna did. Wrong. Oh, it's the, uh, the last room. Or it's quiet. Mother of God. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah. All right, nice. Hopefully, I will not die. Why am I hearing a crying young woman? Oh, hello there. Julia, is that you? Oh, your wife? Julia, it's me, Alex. Are you alright? Oh, no, she's not. Crying friend, a parting gift, but only if they are themselves. I see the small poem written by Sebastian P. Husha. Nobody knows what inspired them. A crying friend, a parting gift, but only if they are themselves. A faceless figure, a room of smoke and death. It guards the door. I see. Oh gosh, she's gone. Julia, where are you? What? People are using. People are usually frightened by this painting, but it relaxes me. Painted in 1922. Okay. Ah, 90, 1798. Ah, yes, the painting from. It must be the one they removed from the staircase. Hell yes, there's 4798. 4798. I gotta write it down. The painting that always seemed to haunt me. August 1747. Hold on. Write it down. 4798. Alright, got the code. Let's go. So am I do I have anything else that I can grab here? Julia and Saul's cradle. Masha and I we were never able to have children, but the Lord works in mysterious ways. Okay. No. How about we don't go outside the goddamn window? Because last time I died and I'm not taking chances anymore. Oh shit, fuck. God damn it, the jump scares. Our father, who art in heaven. Your father in heaven is dead. All right, four, seven, yeah, nine, eight. Mm -hmm. I got another doll. Okay.
Who was left, actually? Time and time again, I find myself on the verge of insanity. If if something bad happens once I step out of this window, I'm gonna lose my shit. Please don't die. Please don't die. Please don't die. He's not dead. He is not dead. That is what I have what had to do. Where am I going? Oh, bedroom. There's a telescope as well here. Sometimes while walking down the street, I have seen Hersher looking up at the stars from the balcony. <gasps> Hello there. I thought you were dead. Mr. Catherine took a journal of her honeymoon. Oh, wait. Do they like give you the, their items? Please come back. We can't leave the house. So are there souls like stuck in the house until I do something about it? If I want to, I could fit under the table. All right, got the Ford five dolls. Is that all you can do here? I'm, I'm, can I make a super character then if I kill off all the characters that have their items passed down to the last character? Yeah, that would make a super character now, wouldn't it? I don't hear anything. Oh, it's a bathroom. Wait, doesn't it have a door that leads outside? Fourth letter from Isaac Faber, a letter sent to Husher on August 26, 1998, found the writer's mansion. Sebastian, I have received the box again. I can't even stand to look at it, but still, I hear its music. After returning it to me, has anything changed? Do you feel better? If so, maybe I should do the same, don't you think? Have you tried to find the previous owner, if that's even possible? Have you discovered anything? Please do tell me. I can't sleep or stay awake. I feel a presence. There is something here with me. Good for you. Good for you. Where's like the main door out of this place? Hmm. Yep, it's there. Oh fuck, what the hell? You must have died instantly. Stupid bird. <laughs> Stupid bird. Alright, let's see about the dolls then. Ah! Fuck. All right, let's do our best here. I do it all right yeah don't lose your cool is the name of the game 
All right, anyways, let's go. Have I lost my mind? Yeah, might be. All right, I don't know about this. Oh, got it. So there was none in the bedroom. An old key. Yeah, okay. Ah! Oh. What? God damn it, what? Who art in heaven? Hallowed be thy name. A faded piece of paper mysteriously appeared in the Husker Manor. Aid us, save us, we are doomed. Wait, do I have to go to all the places where I found, uh, placed the doll in the house? Then there should be one in the kitchen then. Oh God! There's one there. Oh God! How many of these things are there? All right. Bound in slave to his desire. There should be one in the bathroom and one in. What the hell is this platter? Ah, uh, yeah, the one in the steady. Help us it help us make it pull us through. What about that trail? Does something just crawl across the I'm sweating over here. Oh, God damn it. I gotta end this episode. I don't care how many die with my hand. I need to end the episode. Maybe I'll play it a whole episode again to keep all the characters alive. That, but I will do that off screen. All right, woman. I'm sorry, but you are going to die a lot. I think I didn't notice the year icon, the maybe. Was open. Were they waiting for me? Hmm. Yeah, I think I uh, might have... I might have not seen the ear icon. Oh, look at that. There my things are. Hmm. Alright, let's see. Alright, that thing is gone. Oh, now it's not gonna kill me, huh? Is he here as well now? No, they're not here anymore. 
Okay. This is this one. Oh, look at the corpse. Aid us, save us, we are doomed, bound in slave to desire. Help us make it, pull us through, toss the dark one in the fire. Oh, you mean the doll? That weird, creepy black doll? I see, that's why we uh, lit up uh, the, born, uh, the fireplace, because we're going to burn a doll alive. And I say alive, because I'm pretty sure the doll is freaking alive. So what I've learned is if I see anything strange, even slightly freaking insane and strange, I should not take it. I should just walk away. Ignore everything else. Just focus on what you have to do. You don't want to end up dead. I'm not going through there. I am not going through there anymore. See, that's what I said. Okay, silent. Please don't kill me. All right. Oh boy. Let's see what happens. I'm relief now after burning that that horrible thing. Is that the music box? Oh no! Am I gonna go down there? How do I want to skip that? Wait, what's that? Oh, god damn it, it's the junk. Ah, uh, no. key. <gasps> That's what it does. What the? Oh god, why am I going down there? You tell, oh God. Uh, Daniel or Dan Daniel was here. What is this? What language is she speaking? Where am I? It's not interactable. The, those doors are not interactable. This one is. Oh, God. What the hell? Can I not go down? Oh, th there, are, <laughs> the there are no stairs down there. Okay, so there's only one door interactable. <gasps> I use me. Where's him? He's still alive. Help! I need help. You're not getting any. Alive. 
I don't remember much about the ride to the hospital, but I did mumble a few questions about the music box. I had heard it. The endless, grim song it played wouldn't stop hammering in my brain. I would even swear I'd seen it there on the table. The other side of the mirror? No. No. Impossible. There was no box. It was just a hallucination. A mirage. I needed to rest. That was all. Just rest. Oh no. Oh god no. Where am I? <gasps> well, well. It appears as though the Prince of Slumber will be granting us an audience. How are you feeling, your highness? Uh, I had I had a dream. I I'm okay. Thanks for coming, Lydia. Mr. Neuer, my name is Alina, and I found you inside the Hatcher's house. I'm... I'm glad to see you're better. Yes. I think I remember you. Thank you so much, Alina. I owe you my life. Don't mention it. Listen, Mr. Neuer, I found some notes and recordings from the Hatcher family. If you're looking for the Hatchers, you might need them. Oh. Thank you once again. I'm sure they'll be helpful. The truth is, I was thinking of leaving as soon as possible to... Daniel, the doctor said you need complete rest. Complete. I'm fine, really. I found this. Apparently, Husher received a music box from an acquaintance of his. A certain Mr. Farber. It seems as though he was researching the music box when he vanished. And from what Farber says, the music box may be related to everything that has happened. I'm not sure we should stick our nose into this business after everything that's occurred. We need to find Husha. I saw the box that Father describes in this letter, but it wasn't really there. It was as if it were on the other side of... Oh, I think we should pay a visit to this Father and ask him about the music box and Husha. He has a shop in the city not far from here. Daniel, please. I'm fine, really. I think going to a shop and asking the owner a few questions falls within the range of what we can do, don't you? I lost two of the characters. Are they going to get replaced now? All right, so are we going to get new characters then? Oh, we did. Oh, wow. We do get new. Oh, okay. Okay, calm down. We get new characters. All right. All right, we got an officer. Oh, no, I don't want to. Oh, God, I don't want to get him killed. <laughs> okay, let's read about new characters. We got Erica Faber, age 24. Erica managed uh, the Faber and Son antique shop along with her father, Isaac. If he's an art expert, she's managing brains. She's always on the top of every slightest detail of the business. Her adventurous spirit takes her all over the world in the search of new items to adorn the shop's window. Incredibly active, Erica has many hobbies and lets her imagination run wild at every chance she gets. My favorite music, ready to listen on the go, helps me focus and remember who I am. Rena Rain Rene Artigas Artigas A37. Rene was born to be a cop. He will die at die one two. Born in Caribbean, he grew delusioned, delusioned with police department in his hometown and set sail for Europe, where he thought his integrity and sense of duty would serve him better. But the grass wasn't as green as it seems. Tired of moving around, Rene decided to settle down and do what he could help his new fellow citizens. Holster and secure as per safety regulation. I hope I never have to use it. Okay, so he has a gun. And then Daniel Neuer, age 43. Daniel is a publicist and 
an ex-entrepreneur whose failed business venture led him to become an alcoholic. Drinking cost him health, his marriage to Sophia, even his home. Daniel, who has been sober for some time now, has finally managed to secure a stable job and slowly rebuild his life. Wow, he's just the main character. I had to lose it all to find myself. I don't want to do that ever have again. Okay, I'm gonna take her. Erica Faber. Radio cassette. No bonus personal item. Do not carry additional personal item. Nobody collectible. Nobody knows what inspired them. Okay. Makes sense to use the the girl, the daughter of the guy I'm trying to find. I just don't want to use the main character right now. He is going to end up dead. October 1st, 1998. I don't expect there to be anything dangerous here. Hold on. Personal item. In my worst moment, I play my music and forget the world. Rock always helps me find the way back. Why can't I use it? I thought it was going to be like a new background music you can enable to find the key. We sell all kinds of stuff here. We might have to think about opening a second more specialized shop. If I remember uh, the letters uh, from Faber to Sebastian, uh, he stated about his daughter uh, moving around so he wouldn't be able to open his shop again. I think that's the case. I got the key. Found the old key under the flower pot. So her father is gone somewhere. Disappeared as well. I think at some point we can play as Husher. Maybe. And you know what? This is a very fine place to leave it here. 